Yo faces here we are day one dudes we are popping the incense straight away we are looking for Moltres we need Moltres to finish so let's get it done we've got Neil on the map which is a guarantee and we have started just before the hour which is my theory that you will see a Galarian bird every time with a shiny Tapu Fini called Neil and starting just before the hour all right dudes let's pop off we got our first one here it's a beautiful morning let's go now, for anyone joining the party late, we do have Galarian Zapdos and Galarian Articuno. We only need Galarian Moltres to finish the trio. We caught the other two with Master Ball, so that means that we have to catch the next one with an Ultra Ball, because that's all I've got left. And you know what? I'm very excited to do it. Some big mons spawning here, and one of the reasons I'm so excited to do it is because I want to feel what it feels like, dude, when you catch one with an Ultra Ball. With a Master Ball, it's sort of like you know you're going to catch it, so you don't get that same, like, rush of awesome but dude when i catch this and we're gonna catch it it's gonna be insane we're gonna figure out all of the patterns in this new series because we're starting again from day one and we're gonna try and find out what is the key to seeing a galarian bird every time starting with the three minutes before the hour theory here we are dudes with our cross in the road man can we actually draw oh almost we are heading to G-Bird Place. This is a route that I think works almost every time when it comes to finding Galarian birds, dude. And anyone who's watched the other series knows that I've seen wow, about 80 Galarian birds, dude. <laughs> and I've only caught two with Master Balls. But still, this route is proven, and you're gonna see right now. Bro, bro, it worked, it worked. Okay, three minutes before the hour, Neil on the map, dude, it Work, bro! This is insane! <laughs> I'm telling you, man. I have found the pattern for finding a G bird. Okay, dudes, for the first time ever, we are gonna try and critical troll this boy. We just need to set down somewhere. This is it, and we still got some time. So it has worked three minutes before the hour. Neil on the map. This is it, dudes. All right, let's go for this. Let's try to get a critical troll. Okay, so let's see. It's gonna be there. That's good. Did that go back out? There, that's it. Okay, he charges in, and we're gonna try and go for it. This is actually an easy, excellent troll as well. Like, I have been practicing, and we're... Oh, dude, it's just above. No, come on, one. Two, no, stay, stay, bro. Give us another chance. No, damn it, bro. Dude, that is like number 82, but let's keep going because we still have some time on the incense, but the theory is working. We have now just entered G bird place. We've more than enough time to see another Galarian bird. Six minutes on the map, an absolutely spectacular morning, bro. We did miss the critical throw. Eggs popping, eggs popping, let's go. What we got? Mantis and that's it just the one just the one dudes just the one everything is resetting this is so good it's all icy and stuff on the floor it's actually magic man it's just magic oh my god bro Galarian Articuno bro off the same incense bro Neil has delivered bro it's all about Neil bro dude we are critical drawing this 100% I'm gonna drop us down here this is insane bro all right, let's just pop this. All right, two seconds. Okay, faces. Faces! I hope you can see me there, dudes. I have no idea. All right, so we've got that done. We've got our boy ready. Boom. We're gonna try and go for, I'm just gonna go for it like this. Oh, and go for it, dude. It's right there, right there. Boom. No! It reset as I was going for the critical throw, bro. Man, we see Moltres on this and... Oh my God! <laughs> I can't believe it, bro. We did it, bro. Oh, he starts the series saying he's going to catch a Galarian bird. And, bro, it's right there. Articuno. Oh, I can't believe it, man. I've been doing this for one year. We still need Moltres, though. We've got three minutes left. Let's keep going. That's insane. All right, let's get the third one. Let's make the record. I'm absolutely speechless, man. I can't believe it. Today is a really special day as well. 
and I'm gonna tell you why at the end of the video and why that bird is actually more amazing than you know and we're gonna name it after someone who's very important to me man in my life as in like you have no idea but we'll just wait till the incense ends and uh, I, I can't believe it happened today of all days bro it's amazing it's absolutely amazing probably the biggest daily incense i ever have done or i have ever done right there bro look at it all of those pokemon is special we're gonna rename it now to someone very close to my heart it is her anniversary today dudes i'll explain the story but the show doesn't stop there this is literally day one of trying to catch galarian moltres but we actually caught a galarian bird for the first time with an ultra ball Nobody can say I'm a master ball boy anymore. This is it, bro. There it is. Look how beautiful it is, man. Look at that. 13th of the 1st, 2024. This day, man, I think it's 11 years ago. My cousin Lydia died from an asthma attack. She was 13 years of age. And today, of all days, of all days, man, and anyone who's been following me for a long time knows I have been doing this for a long time. I was doing this consecutively last year until I absolutely burned out. I think we made 22 days straight with a full-time job. I didn't catch a bird. Today, we come out after I went over all of my stuff and I said, I think I found a pattern to finding Galarian birds. And I think it's as simple as starting three minutes beforehand and having a shiny buddy called Neil. Now the shiny buddy called Neil is, is just a caveat, but <laughs> this is amazing. So we're gonna call this Lydia and we're gonna best buddy it. Not obviously in this video, but while we're doing the series, Lydia. And it's just absolutely magical that it happened today. I feel that there is definitely something out there, man. When something like that happens and I'm a skeptic, it feels like, it feels like there's something out there, man. Wow. Let's get a meh. meh. My favorite Pokemon right now. Dudes, I will talk to you in the next one of this series. We still have to catch Moltres, but we literally completed the original one and this one. The idea was to catch a Galarian bird. We did it day one. Ain't nobody beating that. All right. I'll talk to you soon. Check this video out because it's absolute fire. And peace and love.